find the value of x and y if 2 raised to power a minus 3 minus 2 raised to power b minus 3 is equal to 5 or 4 where a and b are positive integer hi everyone welcome to my class into this class we want to find the value of a and b from this given equation where a and b are positive integer but before we proceed please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe thank you solution we have 2 raised to power a minus 3 minus 2 raised to power b minus 3 equal to 504 then remember if you have s raised to power n plus m is same thing as s raised to power n multiplied by s raised to power m therefore our equation become 2 raised to power a multiplied by 2 raised to power minus 3 minus 2 raised to power b multiplied by 2 raised to power minus 3 equal to 504 therefore we have 2 raised to power a over 2 raised to power 3 minus 2 raised to power b over 2 raised to power 3 equal to 504. Remember, 2 raised to power 3 equal to what? 8. Therefore, our equation becomes 2 raised to power a over 8 minus 2 raised to power b over 8 equal to 504. Let's multiply all through by 8. Then we have 8 multiplied by 2 raised to the power a over 8 minus 8 multiplied by 2 raised to the power b over 8 equal to 504 multiplied by 8. This one will cancel this. This one will cancel this. Then we have 2 raised to the power a minus 2 raised to the power b equal to 4032 that is 504 times 8 then remember that a minus b is greater than 0 therefore a is greater than what b and we say let a equal to b plus k since we said a and b are positive integer we said let a equal to b plus k so anywhere you see a you put b plus k there then we have 2 raised to the power b plus k minus 2 raised to the power b equal to 4 0 3 2 then we have 2 raised to the power b multiply by 2 raised to the power k minus 2 raised to the power b equal to 4 0 3 2 now but 4 0 3 2 is same thing as 2 raised to the power 6 multiplied by 60 3 therefore we have 2 raised to the power b multiplied by 2 raised to the power k minus 2 raised to the power b equal to 2 raised to the power 6 multiplied by 63. Then our left hand side become 2 raised to the power b is common here. We have 2 raised to the power b here. Therefore, let's factor it out. We have 2 raised to the power b into 2 raised to the power k minus 1 equal to 2 raised to the power 6 multiply by 63 now from here here is even this one is odd this one is even and this one is odd now let's compare the two we have 2 raised to the power b equal to 2 raised to the power 6 or 2 raised to the power k minus 1 equal to 63. Then from here, we have 2 raised to the power b 
equal to 2 raised to the power 6. They have the same base. This one will cancel this. Then B equal to 6. We've gotten the value of B to be 6. Also from here, we have 2 raised to the power K minus 1 equal to 63. Therefore, we have 2 raised to the power K will be equal to 63 plus 1. Then 2 raised to the power K equal to 64. But 64 can be expressed as 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2, 2 times 2, 4, 4 times 2, 8, 8 times 2, 16, 16 times 2, 32, 32 times 2, that is 64. Therefore, we have 2 raised to the power k equal to 2 raised to the power 6. Then this one will cancel this. They have the same base. Our k equal to what? 6. We've also gotten the value of k to be 6. Now, we know that we said a equal to b plus k and b equal to what six k equal to six therefore a is now equal to is now equal to six plus six therefore of a is equal to what twelve if know the value of a to be twelve and the question says we should find the value of A and B where A and B are positive integer. Therefore, our final answer is A equal to 12, Y, B equal to 6. If you have enjoyed the class, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.